Hey everyone, and in this video, we're going to be talking about sleep tracking for the Apple Watch. So I'm just going to quickly put in my password so we can get the video started. So remember to like, comment, and subscribe to make sure that you get five years of good luck and you will have the greatest experience on iOS 14 and watchOS 7. So to start off, watchOS 7, let's just talk about some features. I'll probably have a features video on this, so make sure you stay tuned for that. You can see the animations are super quick. Like when I go to my screen, if I go to the actual app, you can see how fast that was, how swift it is to go to every single thing. And I'm on an Apple Watch Series 3, so this might be a little different for you guys. But you can see how we have the full schedule. It gives you your whole entire analysis. So to set this up, hit on full schedule, and it'll just bring you through a tutorial. If I add another schedule, you can see it'll tell you to choose the days, what time you want to wake up, what time you want to sleep, if you want an alarm. So that, that's pretty self-explanatory. But for now, I've already ran this for one night since this is the second day. We have watchOS 7. And now on my iPhone, which I'm going to get open right now, over here, I can actually track my sleep. So I'm going to go into the health app, which is right over here. It is called health. And just so for privacy purposes, what you want to do is go to the sleep tab, which is right here. If you don't have it, what you want to do is go to the second tab down here which says browse then what you want to do is look for sleep which is right here then you can see your time in bed and your time in sleeping so you can see your next bedtime stuff like that your schedule your heart rate and pretty much everything so it's super cool how it works and something else is that when you swipe down from your control center you have this if you don't have that go to clock and you can see over here sleep is right but if you are about to sleep, turn that on. And now you can see when we turn off our iPhone, turn it back on, it says sleep well with do not disturb. So that's pretty cool how it works. So you can actually use this. And look, when I say shortcuts, I have my wind down shortcuts. So let's just turn that off. And let's see how we can do the wind down. So you can see over here, it'll tell ask you if you want to do the wind down over here. I've already done it, so you can you can customize all these stuff and they tell you a bunch of stuff on the sleep articles, getting a good night's sleep and why sleep is so important, stuff like that. So that really does help when you want to sleep track on your Apple Watch. So remember to keep your Apple Watch on and other than that, go to the Apple Watch app and you can customize your sleep settings, which is somewhere around here. Then you can see it turns on automatically, show time, and this is pretty cool. Anytime your Apple Watch is fully charged, it, it reminds you, it'll give you a little notification up here and it'll say Apple Watch fully charged and it'll notify you right here when it's fully charged. And this is not only during the sleep period, this is during almost any period at all in the day and it is actually super cool. So you can see right now I'm going to plug in my Apple Watch and I want to show you guys this cool little animation that you get. Okay, so once I plug in my Apple Watch, you can see over here that it'll show me down there and once it's done charging it should give me a notification it is already 100% so you can see over here hopefully I can still get the notification when it's done charging but there will be something up here that tells you that I cannot demo right now because my Apple watch is already fully charged so this doesn't work for your iPhone sadly it's only for the Apple watch and external devices so that is it for the video, how you can sleep track on your Apple Watch and how you can track it with your phone. So if you guys did like the video, remember to leave a like, subscribe, comment for five years of good luck. And if you comment first, since you're the first on this video, then you will get a shout out on my channel's posts. So I'll see you guys in the next one and stay tuned for some other videos that are going to come out on the channel. Oh, 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 oh,